So hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to get curls like this for your American Girl doll. And I suggest using it, this technique on dolls with naturally curly hair because this might just like make waves, wavy hair for straight hair dolls because like I guess the material of their hair is not naturally made for curling. So with curly dolls it's easier to get like a nice curl like that. So. Okay, so what you're going to need is some bobby pins. Maybe more than that, it depends on how many curls you want your doll to have. I have enough bobby pins there for six curls. You're going to need a brush because you're going to want to comb out her hair so it's nice and straight so you can make the curls very, like, I guess you could say, neat. You're going to need some water too because you have in order for the curl to stay, you have to wet it and let it dry. You can also use a spray bottle too, but I'm just going to dunk her hair in the water. You're going to want a towel for um, to go around the doll's body so you don't get, so she doesn't get wet because you don't want that to happen. And of course you're going to need the doll that needs some hair recurling here, as you can see. And I also just have another big towel to work on. So, let's get started. All right, so let's get started. I am, like I said, I'm gonna have this towel around the doll when we put her hair in the water. But right now I just have this cape over her. But I don't think this, this is a fake cape, so I don't know, I just put it up there for the looks of her now. It's not even doing anything, but okay. Anywho, the first thing we're going to do is you have to comb out your doll's hair. And yeah, if it's curly, it's going to be hard. It might be hard to comb out, but just got to get it done so it looks so you can curl it. If you want to keep the curls in the same chunks that they're in, like if you want to keep this like this, then just like section it out as you're combing. Or you can just comb it onto one and create your own curl style and size. So let's do that. I'm just going to clean this up and I'll get to you when I'm done. Okay, so after you went around and combed her hair, good time, you're gonna, we're going to start getting the curls ready to go. So just place your towel around the doll so she doesn't get wet and make sure it's covering her whole body because you don't want her, like the, um, fabric part of her body to get wet. So now, you're gonna take your section of the curl, your first curl actually, I should say, and you're going to comb it out, again, just so it's nice and smooth and you're, you have a nice good section and when you unveil the curl that there's not all frizzies sticking out everywhere. So just give it a nice comb, and then what you're going to want to do is take the water, or take your spray bottle, wherever your water is in, and hold back the rest of her hair, like that, and then you're going to dump her hair in the water, oh that's cold, Ooh, chilly, and make sure it's like pretty wet, like all the way up. It doesn't need to be soaking when you curl it though, so you're gonna squeeze some of that water out of her hair. And then, once again, just move that out of the way so I don't knock it over with my clumsiness that I probably would. Comb out the curl again. And then, you're going to I like curling it on my finger because it just has a nice tone. That doesn't make sense, but wrap it around. Slide your finger out. And then you have a nice size barrel curl. And depending on like well, I'll put the bobby pin in first and I'll show. So, once you wrap up your curl, you're going to take a bobby pin 
can place it in the middle and on the other side so it stays in place. So I'll show you what that looks like. Like that. And like the, see how it's like a barrel shape? That's what's gonna tell you, that's how like, when your curls fall down, that's how thick the spirals are gonna be. So if you want big barrel curls, you might wanna make this hole bigger. If you want really tight, small curls, you're gonna wanna roll it tighter. So I'm just gonna leave that up there. And I'm gonna do another curl for you. And I'll do it up close so you can get a better view. All right, so I'm just gonna show you how to do another one here. So you take your section, comb it out so it's nice and straight. You know, curly hair dolls still curl at the bottom. And then you're going to take your tub of water or spray bottle. Spray bottles are much easier to use, trust me, but I've misplaced mine. So then you're going to dip the water in. And there's that noise again. <laughs> That's really weird. I don't know where it's coming from. <laughs> okay. And then you're going to. Drain the water from her hair because you don't want it soaking. And then you're gonna open the So then you're going to once again lock the hair. So it's nice and cleaned out. And you want to take your finger and wrap it around the hair on your hand. Take your bobby pin, pull it off your finger. And then Open the bottom pin, snap it on, get a second body pin, open that up, and put it on in the opposite direction so we'll hold the curl together. And then you're just going to slide that guy on, and there is another curl done. So you're just going to do this as many times as you need to, and just go around her whole head. And I'll show you when I'm done. Okay, so I finished curling the head, and as you can see all around, the barrel curls fall in the same place in the same sections, like these two come a little low, and then the ones in the front are like up closer near her actual head. That's just the way I prefer to do my curls. And here I have a total of five curls, but you can do as many as you like. Like I said, depending on what length you want your curls or like this size and shape. So now the next part is waiting and you have to wait. I'm gonna let this dry for a day so that way when the curls fall, they are going to be firm and they won't just collapse. All right, so. I'll see you for the unveiling. All right, so it's time for the unveiling of the curls. I said that word 10 million times, but it's all good. But I'm just gonna dress her first so I can just go do a photo shoot with her with her curls down, so I'll be right back. All right, so now it's time to release the curls, which is exciting. Woo! That's what we worked up waiting a day for. Am I right or wrong here? I'll stop now. Okay, so I'll take that thing on my own dress. Let's 
spin. That way. So there is your first curl. Let's work our way around here. Second curl. Like it so far. And now these back curls are gonna hang lower because I didn't put the bobby pins right up next to their head, so they're just gonna fall. A little bit lower. And you wanna make sure when you're taking their hair out that the bobby pins don't mess up their hair. Yeah, so you wanna be careful. And do the last one. Sorry. Help them itself out. And then you just play with the curls to get them to your liking. And voila! You have your curls done. And that's what they'll look like. If you have any questions, just comment down below. And please comment, like, and subscribe for more videos. Thanks, guys. So I just used